Back here at home, it may be Monday, but here's one thing you can look forward to, the musical Monday show happening at the Signet Theater. And joining us now with more on the performances and what audiences can expect is Signet uh, Marketing Director Autumn Dorman. Autumn, great to see you. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. Okay, so let's talk about what tonight's show is specifically about, why it's different. Right, so Musical Monday is a quarterly show that we have. It's a cabaret-style musical show. Every show is a different topic. Tonight's topic is getting to know you. So we have five different artists from around San Diego. If you go to theater, you'll likely recognize them. We'll have a Q&A kind of, kind of like a late night uh, Q&A style mm -hmm. segment with them. And then they'll be choosing these musical numbers that represent who they are as artists, talking a little bit about them. And we'll open it up to uh, the audience for questions. For viewers out there, talk about what a cabaret show is. So we've got um, a little bit of talking, a little bit of singing, just kind of like a, think of it as a, an up-close evening with mm -hmm. theater artists. Yeah. And so those who are, are going to be on stage tonight, are they all from the same production, different productions? They're all different productions. You've probably seen them around town. Uh, mm -hmm. We have a couple actors that are in our upcoming show, uh, Rocky Horror Show, that mm -hmm. we've got later in the year, which I'm very excited about. Oh, fun. But yeah, you've typically <laughs> seen them on stage at the Old Globe, the Playhouse, uh, Moonlight, all around town. Is that the next show for Musical Mondays? Well, the next show, actually, for Musical Monday is an evening with Berto Fernandez, and that's July 22nd. And Berto is an amazing theater artist. He was in our last production of Evita as mm -hmm. uh, Peron, Juan Peron. Uh, he's been at the Globe uh, and the Grinch, so he's definitely a prolific actor in San Diego. How long has uh, Signet been doing these Musical Mondays? Oh, gosh. We've probably been doing it at least five or six years. It's one of those things that if you... If you know Signet, if you know theater in mm -hmm. San Diego, people come, they love this kind of up-close interaction with artists. You know, we were lucky to have a few of the actors come in from Natasha Pierre and the Great Comet of 1812. Yeah. Uh, talk a little bit about that story uh, and what people can expect, and uh, it's been extended. It was extended twice. It's been, uh, it's been received very well by audiences. Um, it is a scandalous slice of War and Peace turned into a musical. You do not need to understand anything about War and Peace to enjoy this show. <laughs> Should you show. read it for just background? Yeah, right. I did, just, you know, because. But you do not need to know anything about War and Peace. It's um, uh, the story of Natasha. She's wooed by this um, roguish uh, man while her husband, or her fiancé, I should say, is away at war. And it's just a really unique piece of musical theater. There's, there's melding of all different genres of music, indie, indie folk, um, you name it. It's, it's just a fabulous piece. And of as work. we look at this video, mm -hmm. you notice on the right and left sides of the stage are audience members, right? Yes. Like people are on stage. It's an immersive piece of theater, and it's very unique because you can sit on stage. There's only 16 seats per performance. Uh huh. But we've got, you know. The actors weave in and out of the aisles. You might get caught in the middle of a duel. You might get past a love note. Uh, it's really unique to have those actors kind of immersed in the audience, so very special. You know, it's been extended twice, so will mm -hmm. it be extended for June? I wish, no. May 26th is the last performance, so if you want to see it, you have to go before then. Okay, so that's one immersive experience. Tonight's another with Musical Monday yes. uh, at the Signet Theater. Autumn, thank yeah. you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Appreciate thank it. You. All right.